So Molly Shahnya Mabray is a, a 10-year-old who is resourceful, she's kind, she's determined, and as I mentioned, she's not afraid to make mistakes, and she's just really curious about the world, and that really leads her on all these adventures um, throughout Alaska, and she's a problem solver. She's really good at bringing mm. the community together to yeah. help her solve those problems. I remember I was early on reviewing one of the clips, and um, Layla, the mom, is cutting some muktuk, mm. some whale blubber, blubber with an ulu, which is a, a traditional knife, and my son goes, ah, that's my favorite! And she has that knife you have. Mm -hmm. He was so shocked and elated to see a representation of our lives on the screen. And I got really emotional. Mm. And I was like, oh, my gosh. This is why mm. we're doing this. So that they can see themselves. Everybody deserves to, to see that positive Im image of themselves. And to finally have that in 2019 is just incredible. It's yeah. so meaningful. Thanks for driving us, Mr. Mabray. Molly's Transport Service, at your service. Molly, look, mountains. They look just like the photo. We work with amazing animators. We work for, with Atomic Cartoons um, out of Vancouver, British Columbia, and just everyone behind the scenes has that same, we're all working towards that goal of how do we really do justice and tell these stories in a way that feel authentic and accurate and respectful. I think it's uh, important for young people to know about history, the earlier the better. That it's not a, and we don't go in depth into it because it is a show for kids, right? But yes. we do, we do uh, let them know that it had an impact to not dwell on the negative, but the, the positive. You can get your voice back in, in the importance of, of finding that voice in your language and your culture and seeing the value of that. And, and, it, and it inspires in Molly to embrace her culture, which is the most valuable thing I think you can give a child is, is self-worth and, and self-identity. On the latest uh, Murdered and Missing Indigenous Girls and Women uh, campaign, the report that was released, one of the recommendations, which I think was one of the most important, is encouraging Canadians, all Canadians or all people, to educate themselves about the people around them. Learn their history, find out, make the effort. All the information is there, it's accessible. All you have to do is make the effort with a good mind and a clear heart to learn more about these people that, who's, whose territories you're living in.